Hello guys. Welcome to Cake Scott Coding Series. I am Vishali Anand and today's aim is to check whether an array is monotonic. Let's start writing our program but before that we will see what will be our input and output. Our input will be an array of integers and output will be either yes monotonic or no monotonic. So first of all we must understand what is meant by monotonic array. So what is monotonic array? Uh, a monotonic array is the one in which either all the elements are in increasing order or all are in decreasing order both are considered as monotonic arrays now for finding it let us define our function define function and let our function name be is monotonic or let it be monotonic only monotonic we are checking if it is monotonic and the parameter will be the array a now what it should return it should return 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 all a i is less than or equal to a of i plus one so we are checking here either they can be equal or they can be less than what is the condition after it is that uh, after this we have for i in range length of a capital a minus one and then we have three or two we have two brackets in a row and then we have again a condition or and for in here we have all All of A of I must be any guesses? Yeah, they will be greater than or equal to so A of I and I plus one for I in range length of A minus one. So if these conditions are true, either all are in ascending order or all are in uh, descending order then we will have either the value as true or false it will return itself true or false okay after executing let us write our driver code now inside the driver code we will define values inside the array and let they be 1 2 3 4 5 and 5 six seven seven eight i have this array now let me check if it is running correctly so i will call the function call function and function will be called using friend and function name monotonic monotonic and array is a let's run it we get the answer as true and it is absolutely correct see if instead of 7 i just write here 9 then i should get the answer as false and it is false so values can be same but they have to be either in the ascending order or in the descending order let me give you another example i have the array as 12 11 11 10 9 8 8 and 2 let me check answer should be true and it is true that means our code is correct you can refer the code again if you want that's all for today thank you and happy learning